welcome back to Imperial. So I'm in front of this snazzy looking Peterbilt. Corey, why don't you tell us a little bit about it? Well, this is a 2022 Peterbilt 337. Um, it's a manual transmission, it's a 10 speed, and it's also got a Pack R PX9 360 horse motor in it. Um, this one's a little bit more custom build. We would call it a spec truck or build the order. Um, it was ordered in at a custom wheelbase for a 2,700 gallon. It's a two compartment tank, so it's got 200 fresh water and 2,500 waste. On this one, we did the NV4307 blower, 560 CFM. Nice, neat little package. I'm sure you've seen several of them on our videos here. But everything's nice and enclosed in a stainless steel cabinet. Uh, got a stainless steel 14 gallon secondary here. Got the silencer right here. So everything's all on the same side of the truck. Um, nice and neat with the airlines, nothing going back and forth. Um, here we just have a, you know, a 48 inch toolbox for storage. Protec toolboxes, aluminum box, aluminum doors. Get to the back of the truck. So this one's got a two and a half inch receiver built into our bumper that was done at Scott's Heavy Trucking Equipment. He did all that, even matched the, the red paint on the frame. Everything's all nice and neat. Got a little seven pin flat adapter for the trailer. Um, he did an air intake here on the intake valve. There's a switch right here to operate that. And then also he had us make a little, just a little key fob remote that'll open and close that air cylinder. And it also operates the jetter. We get over there, I'll show you more about that. <clears throat> Backup camera, you can see the camera's mounted on top of the light bar, a couple work lights, three standard sight eyes. Um, here on the passenger side, another 48 inch toolbox for storage, battery air tank cluster. We slid that back so we could put the jetter right up front here. This is a Chandler jetter box. Um, it's got a general pump, 10 GPM, 3000 PSI. And now this here, he's got, he's got controls here to operate it or he can use his wireless remote. And what it would do is turn the PTO on and off for the jetter and also RPM up and down and then it'll open and close that intake valve. So, I mean, I'm sure you've seen our, our bigger um, wireless remote package. This is also an option, just a little bit smaller, just for a couple functions instead of having the full blown remote package. Um, other than that, um, if you wanna come around to this other side, I'll kinda show you how we do that fresh water head. <clears throat> So included with our with our fresh water two compartment tank, we'll do a one inch side hose, a two inch fresh water dump, and it's also got a garden hose fill here if you wanted to fill it from the bottom with a garden hose. Or we do put a, a cap up on top if you want to just dunk a hose up top and fill it a little faster, that's an option too. Yep, so I'd like to give a shout out to Leroy Rest with Sebastopol Construction. Um, they'll be the end user on this unit. It's going out to California, so thanks for your business. Yep, if you guys are interested in a truck like this, give Corey or any of our other sales team a call, 1-800-558-2945, or you can check out our website, subjecttruckcenter.com.